Shane was leaving like hate comments on Lo the Love is Blind Netflix Instagram. At least I showed up on time for my dates, wrong, um, wrong name or not. And he was like, um, love is disrespectfully late if you ask me. Rude. He's, he's a live wire. He's very, just all over the place. Um, and then he posted, let's just make this, all the stuff I have to say about Shane really quick. So then, like, cause Shane went on live really quick, and his, I'm not accusing anyone of anything, because he has very specifically said he does not use any type of drugs or abuse of anything. I think he's just a very erratic, like, Gary, is it Jerry Buse? Gary Busey, the one with the teeth? He's, like, just erratic behavior. His personality, I think, it, it also very anxiety-driven. And um, people were just like flooding him with just like, what are you on? People worried about him. And so this is the Instagram post he shared the following day. What a wild, la oh, la the two days. What a wild last two days. I asked for a ticket to the reunion and the response I got was, thanks for your interest. To most, thank you again for the messages. But for others, every time I go on IG Live, that's who I am. I do it to try and get more comfortable and grow. Saying go to rehab or I'm worried about you every time doesn't help. It makes me horribly uncomfortable looking at the questions and the views with my ADHD. It was a lot. Be better when you get more than 200 followers, let alone viewers on your live, then let's talk. I'm doing just fine, like I said, but it gets frustrating heart. It kind of hmm. pulled at my heartstrings. Like he says he's fine. I guess ADHD is also, I'm assuming... There, it's kind of the severe ADHD, like anxiety ridden, like, and that people just don't understand it. And yeah, that's so his why they mind automatically... just goes, yeah, his mind goes in a bunch of different directions and it kind of just comes out that way. So it's yes. very. So I'm like, I'm not mm -hmm. Shane's biggest fr like fan, but let's just like be nice and not come up with like a assumptions, you know? Yeah. In other words, Barty sucks. That's just straight up. He sucks. Um, Shane, <laughs> like, I, I feel like he's got a good heart. Oh, 100%. I've always thought that, really. Um, and I also think because when we were all waiting to figure out what in the heck was going on with the reunion, Shane was the first one to go live. So mm. I think there was, like, probably a huge number of people that hopped on that at once, and he probably was like, what the crap just happened? Because he ended it really fast. I think it scared him. Yeah, I actually have a video still of it. He, We are like, oh, he's on, like, we're thinking more information. The reunion's not on. And then he immediately just got scared into like, never mind. <laughs> Which I mean, all, like, it takes a lot of guts to go on live. I'm terrified of it. That's why you don't really, I've done it a handful of times. Like, I don't know what to do. I, and it makes you self-conscious. What if people are mean to me? I don't know. It's a, And it's people a are mean thing. to him for sure. Yeah. So that would be even more scary. For sure.